Crisis Group's methodology really uh, proved itself in the case of Myanmar. We were able to get into the country on a regular basis, talk to people in Myanmar in their own language, and talk to senior government officials and those advising them, and understand the debates that were happening inside the country. We weren't swayed or influenced by the debates by exiles in Washington DC or London or people writing from North Oxford or Amsterdam. We were uh, talking to people in, in Napidor and Yangon who wanted change, who were working towards change, and who knew the people who were about to take over government who would bring about this change. And so we were able to see uh, through this sort of on the ground uh, approach that uh, the country was on the, uh, the, the, the cusp of transforming itself in a way that people uh, uh, across the world or in the, in the Western capitals couldn't understand. Since we started translating our reports into Burmese, uh, um, we know that they have a, a very high readership in the, uh, the government in Myanmar. And they're very concerned about trying to uh, identify the issues, uh, that, that the challenges they face, and how they might uh, interact with the international community on those challenges, or how they might re-engage and come in from the cold. And I think we played a very important role in uh, uh, getting the international community ready for this change that was about to happen, and ready to engage, and ready to normalize relations. And I think we, we played a very important role in persuading people that the change was real, that that was significant and that would have beneficial effects for everybody in Myanmar. Uh, by normalizing uh, uh, relations, international relations, it's allowed uh, the, uh, the international community or international investors to start to consider Myanmar for future opportunities. Uh, it's going to be a hard road because uh, this country has been left behind and has very poor infrastructure and poor human resources. But it now can be brought in and there will be opportuni increasing opportunities uh, for uh, investment and uh, you know, uh, engagement in coming years.